Today, we're diving deep into the captivating story of Elon Musk's venture into the Twitter realm. We'll walk you through the timeline of his involvement, the monumental changes he ushered in as he took over, his audacious acquisition of Twitter, and the latest bombshell, the application for a currency transmitter license. So grab your popcorn, because this ride is about to get interesting. Twitter's story began in 2006 when a team of four individuals came together to develop a microblogging platform that would revolutionize communication. Jack Dorsey, a computer programmer, was the mastermind behind the idea of sharing short status updates with friends. March 2006, Jack Dorsey sends the first ever tweet, just setting up my Twitter, marking the birth of Twitter. Fast forward to 2021, when unexpected news shook the tech world. Elon Musk, the visionary entrepreneur, announced his interest in Twitter. When business magnate Elon Musk published his first tweet on his personal Twitter account in June 2010 and had more than 80 million followers by April 2022, in response to a tweet suggesting that he buy Twitter, Incorporated, Elon Musk replied, How much is it? His initial tweets revolved around tech, space exploration, and his companies. But little did we know, this was just the beginning of a roller coaster ride. Skip ahead, and Elon's tweets began taking unexpected turns. From memes to humor, and even some controversial statements, his tweets were magnetic. They sparked debates, sent stock prices on wild rides, and even landed him in legal waters. Musk wasn't just tweeting, he was setting trends. The Twitter deal involving Elon Musk has a specific timeline. It began on 7th August 2018, when Musk tweeted about taking Tesla private. This tweet caused a significant increase in Tesla's stock price. The Twitter deal timeline concludes with Musk's ongoing use of the platform to share updates and announcements about Tesla and other ventures. Now, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Musk began purchasing Twitter stock on 31st of January 2022. On 4th of April, he announced that he had acquired 9.2% of the company's shares totaling $2.64 billion, making him the company's largest shareholder. The next day, Twitter invited Musk to join the company's board, which Musk accepted. This had been recommended to the board by Twitter's nominating and corporate governance committee three days earlier, with some board members expressing concern about potential adverse impacts on stockholder value. The position would have prohibited Musk from going beyond a 14.9% ownership stake and limited his ability to speak publicly about the company. That day, Musk phoned Dorsey, who declined Musk's suggestion for him to remain on the board. On 14th of April, Musk made an unsolicited and non-binding offer to Twitter to purchase the company for $43 billion, or $54.20 per share, and take it private. Though the offer was made to company management, the bid was described as a hostile takeover attempt because of the implied threat to purchase the outstanding stock if management declined. The board responded that it would carefully review the proposal. In a TEDD interview, Musk said he aimed to make Twitter a platform for free speech around the globe, hailing free speech as societal imperative for a functioning democracy. It's really important that people have the both the, uh, the reality and the perception uh, that they are able to speak freely within the bounds of the law. Two days after announcing his bid, Musk registered three holding companies under the name X Holdings in preparation for his takeover. Within three days after Twitter agreed to be acquired, Musk had sold $8.5 billion of his Tesla shares. Business magnate Elon Musk initiated an acquisition of American social media company Twitter, incorporated on 14th of April 2022, and concluded it on 27th of October 2022. Musk stated that he planned to introduce new features to the platform, make its algorithms open source, combat spam bot accounts, and promote free speech. In July, Musk announced his intention to terminate the agreement, asserting that Twitter had breached their agreement by refusing to crack down on spam bot accounts. The company filed a lawsuit against Musk in the Delaware Court of Chancery shortly thereafter, with a trial scheduled for the week of October 17. Weeks before the trial was set to begin, Musk reversed course, announcing that he would move forward with the acquisition. The deal was closed on 27th of October, 
With Musk immediately becoming Twitter's new owner and CEO, Twitter was taken private and merged into a new parent company named X Corporation. Upon acquiring Twitter, Musk promptly fired several top executives, including previous CEO Parag Agrawal. Hundreds of employees then resigned from the company after Musk issued an ultimatum demanding they commit to extremely hardcore work. Under Musk's ownership, Twitter, Inc. was renamed X Corporation, while the Twitter app was rebranded as X. Musk has acknowledged he overpaid for Twitter, which he bought for $44 billion, including $33.5 billion in equity. More recently, he said Twitter is worth less than half what he paid for it. Elon's influence began with a series of changes, focusing on enhancing user experience, reducing toxicity, and fostering healthy discussions. The interface underwent a makeover, making it more user-friendly and intuitive. Elon also led policy changes to address misinformation and improve content quality on the platform. Musk reportedly planned major changes to Twitter's treatment of spam bots, a more lenient content moderation policy, revamp of its offered services, and cost cuts. In the long run, Musk expressed an intention to turn Twitter into an everything app like WeChat. A week after the takeover, Musk revamped Twitter Blue, increasing its price to $8 per month and adding new features, including the blue checkmark verification that had previously been reserved for high-profile confirmed users. Twitter has eliminated the old blue verification badges in an effort to entice more users to subscribe to Twitter Blue. Amidst the crescendo, another chapter unfolded. Musk's company applied for a currency transmitter license, a bold gambit that could redefine the architecture of online transactions. Imagine this, conducting financial operations seamlessly within Twitter's ecosystem. This audacious endeavor possesses the potential to revolutionize e-commerce, with transactions integrated into the very fabric of our social media interactions. X's Rhode Island currency transmitter license was approved on 28th of August, according to the nationwide multi-state licensing system. The move marks an important step forward in Elon Musk's push for X to become an everything app, which would include crypto and fiat payments. While sources have suggested that X's upcoming payments feature will initially only offer support for fiat currencies, Musk has reportedly instructed developers at X to build the platform's payment system in such a way that crypto functionality can be added in the future. Security concerns, regulatory intricacies, and the broader implications for global commerce remain pivotal points of discourse. Elon Musk's acquisition wasn't just a financial transaction. It was a visionary move that could redefine the tech landscape. By infusing his unique perspective and innovative mindset, Musk aimed to steer towards new horizons, pushing boundaries, and challenging the status quo. So, what's next? As we move forward, keep an eye on the developments within Twitter. The fusion of Musk's visionary leadership and company's existing strengths could usher in a new era of technological innovation transforming industries, and shaping the way we interact with technology. And there you have it, the thrilling tale of Elon Musk's audacious acquisition. Be sure to stay tuned for updates on this unfolding story. Hit that like button if you found this video informative, and subscribe to our channel to stay informed about the latest developments in the world of tech and business. Thank you for joining us, and until next time, keep embracing the future.